Welcome everybody to another, possibly the final, Shovel Knight stream for a while. We have done Shovel Knight New Game Plus and Plague Knight New Game Plus. It's now time for Spectre Knight New Game Plus. Never tried King Knight, but honestly, I don't know how much longer I want to drag out these streams. I know I'm itching to start playing other fiends, but at the very least, let's go and have a party with Spectre Knight. There we go, we cleared. New game plus, yes please. Oh wait, before we do that, because, uh, reasons, we're gonna make a little copy of that folder. Alright, now we do new game plus. Start new game plus! Would you like to start a new game plus? You will begin a more challenging quest, but retain your collected equipment. Darkness and will are fused together as one ever-depleting resource. I hate that gimmick. You don't have health, you just have darkness, and any time you take damage or use one of your special items, that depletes, and it's constantly depleting anyways, and it's really hard to get more. So it's basically you're just on a time limit and can't really use any of the stuff that actually makes it fun. So, yeah, uh, this one's gonna be rough. Gonna be rough for sure. Alright, Spectre of Torment, here we go. Yeah, so thankfully our Darkness Bar is way bigger in this story now. But unfortunately... Again, it's constantly depleting, which is not much fun. Hey Katie, welcome to the stream! Hope you're doing well. We just started, so you're right in time. It looks like we're playing as Donovan, but we're playing as Spectre Knight. It's mainly the boss fights that are tricky in this mode, because... If you take damage, that depletes, but if you use the special attacks to avoid taking damage, it still depletes. Aha! I at least, like, I appreciate they tried to do something different other than just be like, oh, no, fewer checkpoints, fewer food, and extra damage from enemies. Like, I appreciate they tried to shake it up a little bit. I just don't like how they did it, but matter of personal opinion. Still, I at least really like Spectre Knight's play style, so... Ooh, yeah, that's good. And thankfully, every time you hit a checkpoint, you get full darkness back. So it's a matter of balancing going fast and hitting enemies. Because when you defeat the enemies, they give you more darkness. We also can't use the Will Skull, because we don't have Will anymore. Ooh! Art, very nice. I always admire people who can make good art, because I cannot. Alright, end of the first stage already. Spectre Knight's campaign is shorter, so maybe it won't be as difficult. Come, Terrapin. Honestly, though, I kind of want to avoid using the relics. Or not relics, whatever they're called. I, always, I can't keep track of what everything... Like, it's relics for, for uh, Shovel Knight, Arcania for Plague Knight, Heirlooms for King Knight. Boom! Get wrecked. It's weird playing as Donovan when he's supposed to be Spectre Knight. Alright, well, we kicked butt on the first level. That's great. I know it's the first level, so it's not a whole lot worth celebrating. Oh, hey, boss. Yeah, I'll help you out. 
for now. Alright. I am going to do something very risky. I'm using the Risk Remnant. Which is, again, very risky because there are only two checkpoints in uh, New Game Plus per level. But I don't care. <laughs> I'm not going to be using it for most of the level. But I will be breaking the checkpoint right before the boss to make the boss fights a little easier. That's fine. You're practicing at the very least, and practice makes you better. And yes, I think I cho chose this armor for the worst level, because Polar Knight is the guy who can actually kill us in one hit. And if he does that, well, I'm going to regret breaking the checkpoint. I also remember this level being really, really strict on the, uh, darkness. Oh boy. Yikes! about you. Oh, thank goodness. Please give me a checkpoint. I am in de desperate need of some darkness. And darkness is not found in any dinner plates. Nope. The darkness. Where did it come from? <laughs> Ouch. Yeah, avoiding enemies is going to be very key on this level. Because there's not enough darkness to go around. <laughs> it's a good thing the Death Knight's not in this game. That would be a much harder fight to get through. I don't have Dark Spike's T. Okay, those guys can give a lot of darkness. If we play our cards right. Oh, yeah. Okay, that was much better. Oh, it wouldn't let me do the slash. There we go. Okay, that went much better than last time. <laughs> So far, so good. Ouch, that was not as good. Okay, yeah, this room's gonna be a pain. This might be one of those rooms where I want to, uh, use the instant dash to the guy move. I have that one equipped. All right, do 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 do. At least the checkpoint's pretty deep into. So if I break the second checkpoint and then die, 
I hope we won't have to replay a bunch of the level. Let's see if we can kick this mini boss's butt. Ah, there we go. Oh my gosh, wrecked! That's what I'm looking for. I forgot I can only do the special slash on the uh, lantern in that particular fight. Okay, let's be smarter about this one. Be a little bit more patient. There we go. Checkpoint? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Beautiful. As tempting as it would be to get that extra power, I'm gonna have to say no. Say no for now, at least. Helps that I've already collected everything. Whoa! Hey. Bomb! Who could have foreseen this development? It is cool how they reuse specific parts of the stage from the previous stories. Yikes. Oh, I appreciate that darkness. <laughs> oh, that's apparently optional. Oh, that's right. Do do. Obviously, we gotta go this way. He was a skater boy. He said, "See you later, boy." Yeah. Now this is where I'm gonna regret <laughs> doing this. Oh no! Oh, I forgot that reduces your darkness! Wait, that's a terrible idea. I should not be doing this. Okay. Yeah, that was a bad idea. I forgot that this also reduces your maximum HP, basically. Mmm, okay. Well, I'm gonna finish the stage, but then we're gonna change armor, that's for sure. We'll probably go to the one that gives us the charge shot. Because none of Spectre Knight's armors are all that useful for defeating bosses. Except for this one, but not in this story. Thankfully, this part of the level is a bit easier than the first part, so it shouldn't be that bad to go back through. Ride the rails. 
Just like it was the Great Depression. Okay, a broken checkpoint. There we go. Phew! Doing that is really safe, but also it saps your life force, so... I generally only like using that when I'm towards the end of a boss fight to finish him off. But that was a perfect time to use it. Okay. We will not be using the risky mail anymore. As it, like, destroys two-thirds of our health bar. Okay, that's not really that good. Rail mail is meh. I guess we're going, yeah, striker shawl. It's still not that good, but. Alright, let's go to King Knight stage. I like how even the slash color changes depending on your armor. That that's nice attention to detail right there. <laughs> the music screwed up big time there. What is wrong with the music? Is King Knight sick today or like what is this music? What is this? This is what is this? Polar Knight's music was not messed up. Out of the way, little squeakers. That is not the way to go. This is a very strange stage. Very strange indeed. Oh, thank you.
Oh, I'm sorry. I thought we were going to be able to slash the book. I guess not. Your internet box is the worst one. Yeah, I have pretty good internet. I not as good as I would. I'm not sure if it's my internet's not good enough. I think it's just my PC's not good enough to stream at such a high bit rate that I would like. So long, bags of money. Oh, right in the guy's pathway. Oh, hey, it's King Knight already. Oh, that's right, I forgot King Knight can also insta-kill us. He even summons the cards! Shoo! Okay, thus far, this is not as difficult as I remember. I still wish I could use more of my... Curios. That's what they're called. Curios. Okay, time for Donovan stage number one. And honestly, I'm not even using the charge shot. Yeah, that is indeed the gimmick of New Game Plus. I don't like it. <laughs> Because it's basically saying, hey, you know all these cool, like, items and abilities that you uh, had, that you got in the first part of your journey? Yeah, you can't use any of them. Thanks, Lewin. We rest here. <laughs> we rest by kneeling on the ground. Nice view, though. Okay, I'm literally never going to use the charge hit, so I might as well just look swag. None of Spectre Knight's armors are useful for New Game Plus. All right, time for the Clockwork Tower. Yeah, don't let your pets mess up your cable box. I slipped. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> well, that was embarrassing. Do, do, do. I mean, I know I'm wearing the roller skating outfit, but still. You 
were just lying in wait to ambush me, weren't you? Ha ha. Easy peasy. Even though I've already died to the lemon squeezy. Uh oh. Watch the darkness. What's my favorite gum flavor? Um, I guess gum. Bubble gum or whatever it is. I don't really chew gum. I've kind of, I finally realized it's like, yeah, this really isn't the best thing to be doing with my teeth, and I don't enjoy it enough to like continue to indulge, I guess. I eat enough sugar as is. I really don't need to add gum to my list of sugary products I consume. Okay, this is bad. I kind of... Oh, yes. I can't believe I'm happy to see a Robo-Rabbit. But Robo-Rabbits give darkness. Woohoo! Oh, thank you. Might as well break it if it's uh, right here. Yay, auto scrollers. Auto scrollers are even worse in New Game Plus. Because they drain your darkness. Oh, thank you, darkness. In darkness's house, it's always lunchtime. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> Thank you for the advice. Yes, don't fall. It's a good. It's a good. Good advice for pretty much every video game. Oh, that was not fun. Oh yeah, you can jump over me. That's actually great. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Uh-oh. Alright, so far so good. Although I think Tinker Knight could be a bit of a pain in this uh, New Game Plus. Because Tinker Knight goes from being one of the easiest uh, Order of No Quarter members to one of the trickier ones. Because he's got more gadgets up his sleeve. Oh, I just realized. Uh... I'm good! I'm good! The Will Skull is not usable anymore. And all of your other stuff, basically, you're eating away at your own health if you use it. It's hard to avoid damage in this fight. So how come my mobile gear couldn't do that? If this takes place before Shovel Knight, then shouldn't this be, like, the prototype? So why can it do more than the actual thing? Whatcha?
Wow, it actually gave me a turkey. I think that's worth the sacrifice. I get the will back pretty much instantly, so... Or the darkness, sorry. Okay, I need to be careful from now on, though. There we go! So you can still use your curios a little bit. You just gotta be very smart about where you use them. Or very cautious, I guess. Good job, Spectre. I think this is where we fight Rees, which I am excited for. Yep, here we go. Hi, Rees. I haven't forgiven you for messing up my final Shovel Knight feat. Use too much will or er, darkness for using the mirror attack. No matter what I do, he just throws his stuff right into me. But there we go. Bye, Reese. Oh, whoops. <laughs> uh, my darkness is still counting down. Thankfully, I don't think you can die when you're in the hub world. Otherwise, I would be dead there. All right, Plague Knight. I thought I was dead there for a second. It is nice getting to st skip all the extra stuff in the level, just go straight to the nitty-gritty. Oh, that was stupid. That was real stupid. I don't know why I did that. I was impatient, that's why I did that. You weren't supposed to jump off of the corner, bro. You were supposed to climb the corner.
I bet the rail mail could be really good if you were good with it. I don't know what that means. Ouch. I recognize the individual words, I just don't know how they form together into a sentence. Skate it, skate! This is basically skate or die. But in this, this case, the dying might go hand in hand with the skating. We're not doing the speedrun, so we may as well just take our time. Take that. I like how my little, like, shadow bounces with the rail. Ouch. Alright, wizard fight? No, not wizard fight. You wish. Oh, no. Forgot about the stupid birds. Ho ho! How do you like that? Now it's the wizard. Okay, this is not good. This is not good. There we go. Checkpoint right afterwards, please. I mean, Plague Knight, who's, the boss is Plague Knight. He's going to be pretty tricky, because he's very... He moves around a lot. Having said that, because Spectre Knight has such a good arsenal of basic attacks, it's probably not going to be too dangerous. And we do get a checkpoint right before the boss. Ouch. <laughs> oh boy. More fire. Oh, wow. Second checkpoint already. Cool. We're at the boss. Ah. Uh, well, sometimes it helps to take your time. Hey, Plague Knight. Hey, fake Plague Knight. Okay, never mind, he was really easy. <laughs> it helps that I can tell which Plague Knight is the real one. It also helps that when he goes in a corner and throws his potions, you can just slash him really quickly. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm gonna regret this. Now it's really skater and die. 
Okay. Oh my gosh, we have the three worst courses for the rail mail, too. I forgot. It would help if you attacked enemies while you were grinding. But alas, no. All right, we die real quickly. <laughs> Skate and die for die more. Yes, exactly. See, you get it. <laughs> the rail mail totally changes your physics too. Oh, okay. See, see, rail mail is really cool when you can execute it properly. I guess, if you can execute it properly. I bet you the speedrunners know how to rail mail, like, the wind. I bet it's glorious. The fact that the rail mail doesn't get knocked back by the Gooblox much at all when you're grinding, that's pretty cool, actually. Like, that can come in clutch. Oh, no! That was on me. I forgot that if you slash while in the air, like, that you absolutely will launch yourself at an enemy. I, no matter how many times I play, I will never get that hit right. Most annoying... Oh, that's easy. On Propeller Knight stage, there are these annoying green guys. Who... They can't damage you, but they always appear near bottomless pits, and they can use wind to blow you into the bottomless pits, instantly killing you. They're awful. All the birders are pretty annoying as well, because they have like 800 HP for some reason. They're the little blue bird guys. Now I've released the birder into the world. Because of all the bottomless pits in this level, I don't feel comfortable rail grinding a whole lot. It's like I'm playing Sonic Heroes again. Cool, we, we reached a checkpoint. Bye bye, birder. See, like right there, birder just ruined me. Thankfully, we got a checkpoint. Darn it. Okay. If I had, if I had wall climbed, that would have been so cool. We're going to try that. Just for the swag factor. I don't care if it takes us a little bit longer. 
We gotta go swag factor. It's the most important factor in the whole game. Boom! Oh, come on! Look how cool that was. the most annoying boss in all of the Shovel Knight game. Um... I guess it depends on if we're including the challenge fights or not. Because there's that one Battletoads challenge mode fight that's just like, how do you even do it? But if we're talking just like main game... Hmm... I'm gonna go with Enchantress. Because she just somehow always can push you in the bottomless pit. Swaggity swaggity. I also hate Reese for purely personal reasons. Not because he's actually a hard boss. Close. No. No, what? I didn't even grab to the, onto the wall. So much money. Oh my gosh. Yeah, rail mail is just. Other than the one really cool swag part, not helping out that much. And it's barely even helping out for that bar. It just looks cool. And therefore, it is top tier. I cry every time. Now that works out just pretty perfectly. Fluctuating height on that can make it hard to time. Oh. Not getting me this time. Hey, welcome back, Proxima. Oh, that sucks. Well, 
Well, we're doing all right. We'd be doing better if I wasn't trying to go for all these dumb swag uh, finishes, but I can't help it. I gotta show the internet I have swag. See? Swag. Oh, I don't need that. Oh, yes. Look at that! Oh, that's so cool! Hey, Mole Knight, do you have swag? Oh, you don't have as much swag as I do. Okay, maybe he does have swag. <laughs> hey, hey, Big D. How you doing? Welcome to the stream. It's vi it's extremely important that we show Mole Knight we got swag. Don't you mean swaggity, swooty? Nah, these jokes aren't funny. I forgot how difficult Mole Knight is in Spectre of Torment. Dane! Okay, this is gonna be a tough fight, actually. Hmm. Oh! Oh, that's it! Dude! Skelebro wrecked him! <laughs> Thanks, Skelebro! Man, he's the guy who really got swag. Oh my god, destroyed! He took out like 10... He took out like 10 HP points in like 5 seconds! <laughs> oh man. Oh, okay. Uh, Skelebro is officially my favorite. Or at least in the top two, right after the Spider Bros. Or the Spider Friends, sorry. That was just annihilation. Sorry, <laughs> it's like I fell down here, and you just... Oh, are you kidding me? Give me a boost. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't read the... F what's my favorite enemy? Um... That's a good question. I don't know. I think I'm gonna go with... The guys that throw the bombs at you in Plague Knight stage. Because they're dressed like Plague Doctors, and I love the Plague Doctor look. Boost, Lewin. Oh, yay, they still have turkey for me. How wonderful. Hi, Shield Knight. This is the only part of New Game Plus that's, like, the same. Oh, I was not keeping an eye on my HP. Shield Knight is hard, because she guards pretty much all your attacks. Like, this is not fair. She can just run at you, and there's nothing you can do to stop her. If you slash, she just guards it, and then attacks you anyways. Like, you have to wait for her to throw the shield. 
And she just might not throw the shield. left. Wait. That counts! <laughs> she landed on one of my little t trap spikes! <laughs> oh. Talk about swag. Ow. <laughs> we take those. <laughs> oh, that was fantastic. Sorry, Shield Knight, you just don't have as much swag as I do. Alright. Iron Whale. We're underwater. Probably not a lot of swag gonna be happening with the rail grinding. But you never know. Into oblivion. Oh, and we can actually use... the hover ability on this course instead of having to get it at the end of the course. Maybe that'll come in handy. Doo -doo. Still disappointed they changed the Iron Whale music, though. <laughs> it's weird, because normally if you defeat the enemy but then you die afterwards, the game makes you reset. This game did the exact opposite. I'm like, should I rail grind it? No. You should not rail grind here. I'm gonna rail grind here. Okay, apart from getting crushed by the anchor, though, look at the swag. See, he got crushed by an anchor, and he's okay. Getting crushed by anchors and living is universal. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, gnarly, bro. Okay, we gotta make sure we don't slash these guys downwards, though. That would be very bad if we did. That goes right into the abyss. And I don't think even the hover ability is gonna save us. Got a shred on the skateboard or whatever it is. That's how you get the A rank. Not really. That's right, you can't climb up. Oop. Shh. 
Oh no, I forgot about Big Bertha. Big Bertha's got no swag. Or all the swag, depending on how you look at it. <laughs> the boss was fishy. <laughs> There's something fishy about that boss. I got swag! <laughs> tells me that rail grinding at this part would not be a good idea, so... Okay, rail grinding at this part is a fantastic idea, though. Treasure Knight's not too bad, even in New Game Plus. Do, 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 do. Yeah! <laughs> Alright, thus far, this stream is... It's, I'm not gonna say it's been easy, but, like, it's definitely not as difficult as I was expecting. New. <laughs> Reese is just like, oh, brother. Is he still rail grinding? You know it. Oh, hey, Baz. I don't know why people aren't allowing him into the Order of No Quarter. If I if I were the Enchantress, I would definitely let Baz in the Order of No Quarter. Baz Knight! Come on, he'd be great! He's got a rope and lightning powers. What more could you ask for? I hate flying machine, but here we are. <laughs> what is ba Baz is more competent of a boss than like any of the Order of No Court, except maybe Plague Knight. Wow, I still get a rotten carrot. That's surprisingly generous of the game. Oh, hi! Don't mind me! Just swagging it up over here. Yeah, I love not being able to see where I'm going. I don't die 50 or 100 times. Not this stream. Or any stream, to be honest. Oh, that's right. 
keep forgetting to do this. Uh oh. Can you die from. Okay. Thankfully, you can't die from just running out of dark. You have to get hit by something in order to get the final actual death. So you're not completely on a time limit, but you kind of are. Oh, there's the checkpoint. Ha ha, that was perfect timing. Oh no, I didn't swag it up. Oh no, I didn't swag it up! <laughs> Hang on. We're, I died on purpose because I wanted to try this fan part again. But this time with swag. Okay, well. <clears throat> this time with swag. Whee! <laughs> Beautiful, see? Like I said, I totally died on purpose because I wanted to show off how cool that strat is. These guys are the worst. That's right, you can't wall climb when you're slashing, so I slashed at just the wrong time. Oh! <laughs> okay, I believe you. No, you can't stop my swag. No! But I was climbing up. Apparently if you slash while you're climbing up from a wall climb, you just sink like a brick. I've lost so much money. I started this with like 40,000. Wait, I made it up that time? I don't understand. It's like. I lost my swag. Can't be true. Yeah, like, all this time, I'm actually making the jump real easily. So, on my fruit, why didn't I do it that one time? Oh well. We did it this time. Thanks, dude. I didn't push jump in time. Whoops. Yep, this is Propeller Knight stage. I got the speedrun strats down. I just need to, you know, actually pull them off.
Okay. I need to stop. I just need to stop with the rail grinding when I don't need to. Like, it's making this level take way longer. But if I master it, then it could be shorter. There we are. Woohoo! I was about to say, man, you're way easier, but I forgot about this part. Skadoosh! Yeah, Propeller Knight, easy boss for Spectre Knight, kinda tough stage. Although, Spectre Knight's version of that stage is all much better than in every other character's story. Alright. Lichyard time! I would love to go to the Lichyard. <laughs> That again, but this time we actually have swag. Oh, yeah, see? We don't even need to use the trees when we got this much swag. No, when the lights are out, you can't see my swag. Wow, checkpoint already. Oh, that's right, I forgot. Yeah. This part does not have swag at all. Oh, swag got me killed. No, lack of swag got me killed at the beginning. If you try swag, but it, you don't succeed, then that doesn't actually count. Okay. 
Wait, is this the end already? No, okay. I'm like, this... <laughs> I remember there being more than this. There we go. Bye, Skeletor. Platforming sections that I like the best are the ones where you can't see where you're going. Oh, yeah! Time for swag! Hi, Phantom Striker. Won't you join me? If you do, I'll make your face the greatest in Korodai. I remember this fight took me ages on my first New Game Plus attempt. Because I kept using the mirror, and I'm like, why do I keep dying? It's because the mirror saps your darkness. And there you go! This. <laughs> Oh yeah! Okay, no, as long as you don't just use the mirror all the time, this mode's actually not that bad. I feel like this is easier than Shovel Knight New Game Plus. I'm sorry, folks, I was wrong. <laughs> swag, 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 swag! I'm never taking this off. <laughs> swag, 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 swag. Oh yeah, hi, Black Knight. Hey, dude. Tower Fate Entrance. This is a level where you really gotta control your swag. Otherwise, things will get out of hand. Beautiful, yes! I, I have darkness still, a little bit. Yes! <laughs> the will of the so I, I, it's just to look cool. This is the part I always screw up on, because I keep 
I always jump at the wrong time. Wow, first checkpoint is real far into the level. Alright. You aren't better than me. I don't think rail mail is going to be a safe option on this level. Darkness. My favorite topping at Burger King. Missed the cycle. If I had more swag, I could have made the cycle. Wait, why did I do that? Okay, here we are again. Don't want to jump off of those walls, otherwise... You oh, I, I died right before the checkpoint. That's how it usually goes. Burfa. Big Burfa, no! How could you? <laughs> Big Burfa does not mess around. Kills you so fast. These guys just always hit me when they first appear. Yes! Oh yeah. <gasps> Excuse me, sir. Big Burfa is trying to kill me, and I don't appreciate you hitting me with a mace over. Oh, no, okay. Nope. I remember. This room is the auto-scroller that you absolutely do not want to rail grind in.
<laughs> I love how the background just changes color. Not seamlessly at all. Oh, hey! Now we literally need swag. No! My swag! I didn't have enough time to swing. I landed too close to it. Okay, I was literally swinging that whole time. I'm in Michigan, so very cold. give the cold shoulder that easily with this armor on. You have to be standing still, otherwise you start doing the rail grind. Nope, like that. Oh, hey. We've been in this situation before. Again, I just, I did not have enough time to swing. I swung as soon as I hit the ground, and it wasn't enough. I think Alaska's got us all beat, though. Yeah, some of us are in the north. <laughs> the old country. <laughs> Where winter meant you went off to war. <laughs> Well, I'm glad I am not in Alaska for that. Because I don't like cold temperatures. Yes, I am in the wrong state for that. Okay, I got more darkness this time. Okay, good. Yeah, you.
This guy's annoying because, like, every time you hit him, it's like, oh, you actually hit his turtle, which doesn't deal any damage. Ouch. Yeah, this fight's annoying in New Game Plus. Because his turtle's hitbox is so big. Consider yourself lucky if it doesn't snow in Arizona. Damn, this is tough! I do not get any openings to just rapid slash him. I feel like every time I damage him, he damages me back. And in New Game Plus, that's not a viable way to win. Should I call on Skelebro again? Like, all this effort just to hit him one time. Now we're getting into a rhythm. Oh great, now I can't even do my homing attack. Oh no! Okay, I didn't think he was... No. Yeah. Knocked him down immediately. That's great. If I can just stop him from riding Terror Pin again, that's great. No such luck. I'm so how did that damage me when I did a slash attack right at him? Come on, you got no swag. Okay, can you please stop missing with that expensive darkness-powered attack? Please and thank you. Oh, you just stupid sparks. 
frozen grass not quite the same thing. This is where I remember the gimmick being real annoying. Because it is. Okay, stop. I hate it when they're both together, because then I can't hit either of them. So how is his turtle pet riding in the air? No! I was trapped! Okay, that attack is doing absolutely nothing. New plan. Once he goes on the ground, I'm going to call Skelebro. Well, that did absolutely nothing, and he didn't even stay on the ground for two seconds, so... Skelebro still did more than the moon attack ever did. Okay, Skelebro helped out a tiny bit, but not really. Hmm. Barrier Lantern, maybe? Oh my gosh, why did you attack Terrapin and not the Black Knight? I don't even know what the heck is going on. Because Spectre Knight refuses to diagonal dash the Black Knight, he always does it to Terrapin, which just knocks him away. Like, look at that! Why did that not hit the Black Knight? Why did that inflict damage on me? Gone it! I always get cornered down there. 
Like, no matter what I do, it's just him and Terrapin are right there, and I can't do anything about it. Sentry is actually draining my darkness even after I use him. Maybe just the generic spike attack. Hmm. No. It's certainly not harder than Lost Kin when they expect you to do it in the story. For some reason, this fight, and like only this fight, you can do the air dash slash at the guy, and you take damage instead. And if that happens a bunch, you're just screwed. Why would you even ask such a question? Why? You know for a fact that's not true, like the answer. Seems to be okay. The float attack seems to be doing a little bit better.
hairpin. No, what? See, again, I was cornered. Nothing I did would have gotten me out of there. Because Terrapin was just marching towards me, and then he chucked that third Earth up at me. This right here is a perfect example of a boss where it's like you basically need the Curios to be able to effectively damage it. But if you use the Curios, then you just die. Wow, sure, that's totally a fair attack that can be dodged. Oh my gosh, he's at one health. What? You didn't even try spe- You didn't even go in the remotely the right direction with that attack. Die! I don't know why I damaged him when I definitely hit Terrapin there, and I wasn't damaging him when I definitely did- I, That whole fight was bass backwards, so to speak. Well, we did it. And then Spectre Knight had to go back to his sitting position. Alright, here we go. That was definitely not fun. And speaking of not fun... Sure. Wow, that is a lot of blocks that fly your way. There we go. Oh, apparently that wasn't the right way to go. You'd think I would know that, since I've literally played Spectre Knight's story recently, but nope. Look, triple cape twirl! Ah. Again, like, none of these endgame gimmicks are fun. It's like, what if we made blocks that appear, but they only appear when you're standing right above them, so you have to make blind jumps in order to... It's like, why, why would you think that's a good idea?
Those are some big stained glass windows. is useless for I have bought everything literally stuck inside uh, in between two blocks there. Oh, I was out of dark. Whoops. At least we have a checkpoint. Skelebro, help me. Skelebro just ate away at my HP. Honestly, probably more than the boss's HP. Enchantress is the true most annoying fight of the whole game. In every story, she's awful. You know guys, I'm starting to wish I had stuck with the charge shot armor. I forgot about Spider Scythe. And now for the final boss, who's like randomly like the easiest part of the game. Or like one of the easiest parts of the game. Hi, Nightmares. And now it's the swag fight. Everything was leading to this. Do we have swag or do we not? Swag! 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 Ha! And yep, there we go. Bye, Reese. Cool. New game plus done. And it only took twice as long as the game expects it to.
Now remember, I think this all teaches us a very important lesson. The most important thing in life is swag. I'm kidding, by the way. It's just a joke. It's not the most important thing in life. And if you don't know that, you're a dope! I will stare at the phase locket until Plague Knight steals it. <laughs> Achievement unlocked. Again. We do it all again. Yay. Alright, well, New Game Plus was actually pretty fun until we got to the end there. Which is such a shame. Could have been great. Oh, I, we haven't done, like, any of the feats here. Use only Curios to defeat any boss. Ooh. That's interesting. What do you mean, already finished? It took a half hour more than it. Uh, my streams normally do on weekdays, so... There we go! That's gonna do it for Shovel Knight. Um... Still have to think about if I want to do King Knight New Game Plus. I'll come, I'll come back to it eventually, but I'm debating giving this a break. Either that, or maybe I'll do, like, a special... Mmm. Okay, guys. I... Because you guys joined chat so diligently, I will... I will kind of voice this. Should we just say, alright, we're gonna leave Shovel Knight there, and then we can stream it again in the future, but not right away? Or should this weekend stream be basically wrapping up all the stuff we want to for Shovel Knight, which would be Keen Knight New Game Plus, and then any remaining stuff we want to do? I could do that for Saturday's stream instead of something else. What do people feel like? Do people think I should do that? Weekend Shovel Knight sounds good. I think that... I actually kind of like the sound of that. I was planning on starting the new stream series, but you know what? I think this gives me a little bit of a buffer. And yeah, I like the sound of this, because that way... I don't know how long Keen Knight's New Game Plus is going to take. I don't even know what to expect for Keen Knight New Game Plus. It could be really hard. And his story is longer, so a weekend stream would give me enough time to do that. And it would kind of wrap Shovel Knight up nice and neatly and allow me to start some new stuff without being like, I gotta go back eventually. So yeah, yeah, okay, that sounds good. That sounds good. I will plan on that. We will finish up Shovel Knight on Saturday for one final mega stream. And then, after that... <laughs> oh yeah, it will be Shovel... Mm. Oh, that's true. We Saturday is... Mm, maybe I'll do Shovel Knight's stream on Sunday instead. If I can find a funny April Fool's game to stream, I might do that. Maybe we'll get two weekend streams. I'll have to think about it. But we will stream Shovel Knight at some point this weekend. So, look forward to that. Thanks for watching, everybody. It was great chatting with you all. Hope you have a fantastic rest of your night. And God bless, everybody.